Why, hello everyone, it's Starfield. We're in Neon, and Billy Ray Cyrus is still waiting for us. Anyway, we're supposed to talk to the Sleep Crate Manager. Well then, let's go. Earlier today, there was another update on Steam at about 700 megabytes, and uh, I haven't checked what exactly was in there. Hopefully it was some bug fixes and uh, hope it would kill the lagginess or the lags or whatever you call it. You know what I mean, right? That was so annoying when I first played it. Like it would stutter and stutter and lag and uh, people would start talking and I would hear that but I wouldn't see their face move. Uh, their mimics, right? No. There you are. Right. Careful around here. Isna Sundar Rara. Okay. Reputable. I like some details on purchasing a sleep purchasing a sleep crate. Uh, sleep crates for rent. It's tight, but it's home. Yeah, it's still laggy. <clears throat> Too bad. Good for you. You can at least get some privacy that way. No weird stains, save the ones you spill. What? And it just so happens we have a deluxe shipping crate that recently came on the market. Built for cargo, redesigned for people. Just the thing for a minimalist like yourself. And uh, no, no. What do you mean minimalist? It's an artist's way of saying less is more. Minimalism is about shedding life's excesses. One night in a sleep crate and your desires, comforts, and hygiene will molt away. Uh, no. Smart choice. I'd say you dodged a bullet, but you're the one holding the gun. People actually live in there? That they do. It's the families that really get me. And when those families can no longer even afford a sleep crate, well, that's just my favorite part of the job. Yeah, so can you tell me about them? If you're struggling, sleep crates are the budget accommodation choice of Neon. It's tight, it's got a smell that's an acquired taste. If you're in the market for a sleep crate, they sadly sell themselves because they're very, very cheap. Yeah, so I'd like access to Nesharo's money. You have the proper authorization code, and I'll let you into any place you like. I might even throw in a thank you. You look like the type that might appreciate it. More of an observation. Not much to do around here, except to clean up after people that have partied too hard and drink. Don't get much of a chance to talk to the respectable type. Yeah, I suppose respectable types wouldn't sleep in here. I got it, I got it. And... Authentication is all green. Look for C-153. Before you go, I'm going out on a limb here and assuming your account's more flush than my usual clientele. I've got some evicted crates set up to go to the dump. Might be full of weak old Kazimbas, or it could have the original Miguel Rafael Bailamos. Only one way to find out. Uh, wasn't the original Bailamos destroyed? Even the reprints are worth a fortune. In art school, I heard a rumor that Raphael's son sold Bailamos to some UC magnate. The fire was a cover-up. Imagining a piece of free star history in some Deimos Corporation boardroom? Wars have started for less. Man, it's nice to talk about something real. You've made my day. Eh... Uh... A brilliant piece of art. It celebrates when the colonists first broke ground on Polvo. 
The vids make it look stunning. All done in charcoal from the embers of their first fire. Well, so the story goes. <laughs> nice to be able to use my art history degree for once. Pro tip, when your parents say there ain't no use for a degree, they aren't lying. Yeah, well, I'll take a chance on the crate. Great. Unit C203 is now keyed to you. Best of luck. Go. Well, did I just buy a crate? F um, I thought... Actually, actual families live in there, really? I mean, families. Wow. That's horrible. I'm feeling good now. You feeling good? Yep. I'm perfect. <clears throat> so we got the package, we need to speak to Yannick Legrand. Where we, where, where, what, what, blah, 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 sorry, I need more coffee. Where am I going? Madame Sauvage. Right, um, trade authority, um, I don't know if I can ever live in a place like this. Two visits. Miserable hermit on Aquila. You think he finally regrets disappearing all those years ago? No. I think he finally ran out of credits. <laughs> no wonder you're stopping up. Yeah. Hello, Yannick. <clears throat> yeah, you'll need something. Yeah, sort of. If you're here for blend, I just had a new batch come in last night. That's a mysterious name for a beverage. No oh, mystery, the name says it all. Look, I don't have time for chit chat. I've got a lot of business to take care of, so if you don't mind hurrying this along, that'd be great. As soon as word gets out, blend is back in stock. <laughs> it's going to be a stampede. I'd like to buy some liquor, please. No, not yet. Why is it so popular? Probably because you can't buy it anywhere else except at my shop. And I mean anywhere. 
as in the entire settled systems. It's got a special blend of secret ingredients that you can only find in Neon. Uh, if, if it's that addictive and we're Neon, there must be Aurora in it. All right, genius, you guess the main ingredient, but you don't need to be yapping about it in public, you know? For your information, the distribution of Aurora anywhere except the Esro Lounge is illegal. Off the books, that shit flows like water around the city. Have you ever thought of selling Blend outside of Neon? No, are you crazy? I've got a captive audience here. Business is booming. Blend is part of the Neon charm. It's iconic. Not to mention that Blend's mix of special ingredients can only be found here. Well, how's business? What are you, the nosy type? Yes. Why do you care? But if you must know, business is good. It's always good. Blend is a local phenomenon. It gets people in the door. So are you going to buy any, or are you just going to talk my ear off? Nashar sent me. Oh, yeah, right. You're with Nashar. I see the family resemblance. You're practically twins. I know he got pinched. So if you are some undercover neon security goon here to shake me down, beat it. Yannick's no one, Mark. Uh, no, we're not trying... Uh, whatever, is this how you treat someone trying to help you? Well, Nesher wouldn't work with it. Huh, unless he had no choice. What is this about? He told me to deliver this. Oh, really? Huh, fascinating. So Nesher came through. Yeah, might be he's less crappy than I gave him credit. <laughs> Who am I kidding? He's a bottom feeder. But when all the good fish get gobbled up by corporations, sickly minnows are all that's left. Take the credit. I am known far and wide for my generosity. Ask anyone. Nesha was really worried you'd ruin him. Yes, yes. He is loyal. <coughs> Loyalty will be rewarded. You look like talent. Serious talent. And no one knows you. Yes. You are looking at the one and only maker of Yannick's blend. It's potent. It's good. And as a jackhammer of a kick. Uh, the kick is the problem. But you... Maybe a solution. I'm thinking a new, cleaner, smarter operation. With you working for me. Uh, I have a feeling there's a catch. Ah, and smart. I like you. Blend needs Aurora, yes? And Aurora is totally illegal outside of the Astral Lounge. And really, really illegal off-world. If the Rangers catch you with Aurora on a ship, oh boy, that's a long time in the clink. And if the great Benjamin Bayou finds out you're selling it on the streets, even bigger trouble. But so far, I have outsmarted them all. And together... We can keep making loads of credits and making a fool of the great man Bayou at the same time. Uh, I like the bit about making lots of money. Very, very good. Nesher's worthless to me now. Loyal, yes, but he'll be watched from now on. And my other employee, the Felix Sadler, makes Nesher look like a genius. I think it is time Felix Sadler 
takes a vacation. Permanent. Off-world. Or maybe he tragically falls into the ocean, I don't care which. But you deal with him. And you become very valuable to Yarnik. Yeah, that sounds good. This is the start of something beautiful. <laughs> if we're doing this, I'd feel a whole side better if Felix makes it out in one piece. Felix sacks up in some dingy warehouse in Ebside. You will find him there. Find Felix Sadler. And... Good? Yeah, I'm good. What do you think? Kill him or just scare him off? I'm always thirsty. Wow, that's kind of like it. It looks awesome, and actually, I'm not sure I'd like to live here because all the lights would be too much at a certain point, but. I'd like to visit there on the holidays, at least. Right off the app side. Madame Sauvage. Security's got its eyes on Saburo Akadimbo. That guy's trouble for the status quo, if you know what I mean. No, I don't. But maybe we should talk to him. Just amazing how many little side missions you find by walking by people, you know. Neon's got an energy to it like no other. Mm-hmm. Sorry, that was my coffee. Oh, oh crap! Um. Dumb. That was dumb. That was really dumb. Oh, you're a dead man. No, you are. Okay. Oh, what she was. Why? Now, now I'm sorry for her. Hey, Felix. You were awesome! Did you see yourself? Those Sioka Siddiqui freaks had no chance! Yannick came through! That asshole rescued his boy! Tell him I won't forget, we are tight! <laughs> Actually, about Yannick, uh, 
Why was the syndicate gunning? Like I have any goddamn idea. But they'll regret messing with Yannick, yeah. Yeah, actually, he gave me a choice. I cannot be hearing you right. Oh, world? Just pack up and go? No, no, no. That, that can't be right. I mean, Yannick screwed without me. We had big plans. Big! Tell you what. Screw Yannick. I hope the syndicate string him up and execute the bastard. And screw you too. Yeah! Just so I don't have to kill you. You understand I'm saving your life. Oh, I feel so honored to know you and how you're saving me from my own damn life. Yeah, so? You expect me to just... I mean, after what you did to all the... All right! Sheesh. I'm leaving. Tell Yannick I'll miss him. Or maybe not. So we're done here. Goody. I'm leaving, damn it. I just need to take care of a couple of things. All right. So, in the end, <clears throat> I didn't have to kill him, but four other people. Alright. Well then, off to Yannick. Madame Sauvage. Personally, I think Neon's the heart of the Freestyle Collective. Yeah, sort of. I don't know. Hey there. Hi. Just another lousy day in Neon, am I right? Yeah, sort of a lousy day here. Deal with Felix yet? Yes. I'm sure it was a great pleasure. Yeah, not so much. Consider him out of the picture. Any idea why the syndicate was there? Shit. Shit. No, I do not. But I will find out. Consider him out of the picture. Get resolved. Like me. <laughs> well, hopefully not too much like me, right? <laughs> So, now, new business plan, where I am the boss and you are my capable and well-rewarded underling, yeah? See ya. Yannick's blend is running low. Soon there will be angry customer, and that's bad for business. What we need is Aurora, and there's only one place to get that. Zeno Fresh Fisheries. Oh. Nasher worked there and had a secret contact, even secret from me, his good friend. Who supplied the Aurora? Right. Sounds like he was doing a good job. Maybe. No longer important. So it is time for you to become a productive member of society and get a job at Xenofresh. And here are some superb and very 
legitimate credentials. And your new name is... Riley Chernyshevsky. Ah, nice to meet you, Riley. <laughs> so you apply there to work in production. Oh, uh, you know how to make amp, yes? Simple recipe. They expect applicants to know basic chemistry. Of course not. Amp is steroid. Very strong, very powerful. Legal for the moment. Neshar said one of the interview questions is about this. I have no idea how to make it. Use the research station over there and analyze these. I am sure you'll figure it out from there. So you need to put on your best suit, Riley, and make a good impression. Neshar's contact boss. should be looking for someone like you. So find them. Then we line up more Aurora and profits will flow. Eh. I gotta tell you, man. Blend is the best. Come of on. course. Your secret's safe with me. What are the secret ingredients, huh? <laughs> Glad you like it. Research lab lets you discover new crafting recipes by completing research projects. Each project requires materials in order to make progress. No Goody. Pharmacology. Performance enhancement, oh, medical treatment, it's food and drink, outpost equipment, right. weaponry. Just tell me. Um. Ingredients will stay a goddamn secret. Now leave me alone. Old Earth cuisine, beverage development, mixology, outpost development. Really. <laughs> okay, uh, research performance enhancement one. Right. Untrack project? No. Okay, so I track that. Oh, right, I, I already got that in my inventory somewhere. Okay, that's a bit complicated. Mission status activities. Goody. Apply for a job at Sino Fresh Fisheries. I will, but uh, let me just sell stuff in the meantime. Yes. Always. Can I sell you some Just stuff? I want to say again, I'm grateful for the help you gave. 
Getting Dietrich to stop those payments. Sure, no problem. How are things going? Much better, thanks for asking. I don't exactly know what you said to Dietrich, but he certainly turned everything around. He's really stepped up and taken an active role in fighting Neon Security's corruption. He's even organizing the merchants' meetings with me. But best of all, I think we've become good friends. What? Which is a rare thing to come across in this city. I can tell you that. Well, let me know, right? Uh... Let me know if we can make a deal. I'm sure about that. So... What, um... Oh, whatever. Uh... Okay, so this one uses 27, this one uses lasers, 27. This one uses point twenty seven, three kilovolts and seven seven seven. Yep, that's fine. Uh, I should buy some point twenty seven ammo though. Which he doesn't have apparently. Oh. Oh, the veteran's ground crew space suit. Fifteen for all. Unified transport? Nah. Apparel. Uh, disciples flameware. No, 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 no. Ninety thousand credits. Wow, that's a lot. Thanks for stopping by our shop. You're welcome. But I should definitely get some more credits because I want bigger ships and all. Your safety is almost guaranteed. <laughs> All right, nice. Okay. Yeah, Frank Rennick's all in a twist because his robot got vandalized. We had a good laugh about it back at the station. Really? Benjamin Bayou is so not compensating for any man. You don't maniac. So instead of starting a new life, free of all my completely self-reliant, the family returned to Astral Lounge. I mean. Confession time, I used to blow off some steam there. Bad idea. Oh, why is it a bad idea? Uh, see no fresh, yes, please. I don't know what's wrong with me, but Neon might be my favorite place to visit. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Welcome to Xenofresh Fisheries, the pride of Neon. Well, um, I'd like to apply for a job. Welcome to Xenofresh Fisheries, the pride. You've 
come to the right place. Xenofresh is always on the lookout for new faces to add to our family. The application kiosk is over there, but feel free to ask me any questions. Do you have any work for a chemist? Job candidates with background in chemistry are highly sought after here. I highly advise you to look at the application kiosk. Uh, what's it like to work for Xenofresh? Xenofresh is the best place to work in Neon, hands down. The pay is good, the hours are respectable, and the company's profits are skyrocketing. We're fortunate that Administrator Bayou dedicates his time and brilliance to see our company excel. The Free Star Collective has given Xenofresh Fisheries the sole right to fish chasm bass and use it to produce Aurora. If you care to sample some yourself, we have it for sale at the famous Astral Lounge. Yes, Although please. Aurora is our flagship product, we also produce a line of delicious seafood products as well. Thank you for visiting Xenofresh Fisheries. Oh, that's so cheerful I could die. Be careful if you run into those ecliptic jerks. They fly around like they own the set of systems. And they like to use old abandoned facilities as outposts. You know, the ones left over from the colony war. Yeah, I know. I've met him before. Production line chemist. Scan ID and apply for position. Uh, what would you list as your greatest strength? Strength, Riley Chernyshevsky. <laughs> My greatest strength is the lack of weaknesses. <laughs> no. I'm a hard and diligent worker. What's the highest level of education you you received? The um, high school diploma or equivalent? Create a rough diagram of the chemical structure of AMP. Thank you for your interest in Xeno Fresh Fisheries. Submit your application and talk to the receptionist for the next steps in your exciting adventure. Yes, please. Riley, oh god, is that Cherny Sheetsky? Cherry? I'm so sorry. Miss Gurov would like to interview for the position. She's in the underbelly on the factory floor. She'll be expecting you. Uh, okay, sure. Have a nice day. Why are you so cheerful? I think I got them. What do you call them? Corns? Yeah, I got corns. Yeah, me too. Report to why is it an app site? Yeah, I'd like to speak with me only if you have what it takes to do tracker work. I'd like some Terra Brew, please. Thanks for choosing Terra Brew. What can I get you? Please take your time. Uh, classic, please. Enjoy one of our distinct coffee flavors, all brewed using the secret techniques of ancient herbs. 
Yeah, I need some coffee, definitely. Also, real life. Yes. If I have to eat fish for dinner one more time. Let's go to the underbelly of Neon. Yeah, that's where we arrived. Right? I mean, maybe not this exact area right here, but, you know... Wondering, I, I I'm not sure I want to eat that, <clears throat> or this thing. Let me try that. Oh. I thought I would glitch out of the picture or something. <laughs> right. Um, thanks for watching. I'm your gaming cat dad. See you next time.